Notepad is about to get a major upgrade, and trust me, you'll want to see this. In the next update for Windows 11 25H2 and 24H2, Notepad is getting table support, and you are going to see a sneak peek of it. So let's open Notepad. Okay, so now that we have Notepad open, here on the top bar, here's the table icon, the new icon for tables here. If you click on the down arrow, you can insert table. Five by five is the most you can do in the column here. If you want more rows and columns, you click on insert table. So let's go seven columns, seven rows. Okay, so now we can insert word words in rows. If you want to edit the table, you just right click the table and edit table. Here you can insert another row or column. You can select the table, the whole table. You can select the column or row. You can delete the table, column or row. You can fit columns in window width. So here you can adjust the, the row or you can adjust the column up and down. If you want to delete the table, just highlight it and click on delete. So let's do another table here and you can, let's do good here and then day. We'll just type some words in here just to Google. For some reason that might be a bug in notepad. Because that is not what it's supposed to do because we actually deleted the column, but I actually deleted the whole table. So that is it for this episode. And for more sneak peek on the latest Windows 11 25H2 updates, subscribe and turn your bell notification on. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace. Hey, did you tell them the other feature in Notepad that is coming? No, Cortana. That feature is only for Copilot Plus PCs. And not everyone is going to have it. But the table support, everyone will have it. Mm? What? And who is Copilot? Oh, you will soon find out.